the world demand for proteins of animal origin is growing every day and uh, the production of protein from aquatic animals is uh, very very interesting to feed the planet and uh, we know that uh, the diseases of aquatic animals decrease the production for more than 25 percent it is why uh, we would like to provide our members with prevention and control methods in front of that problem. We invite uh, scientists to help the discussion in the field of advice to all uh, participants. We think that that conference involving for the first time 120 countries in the field of uh, the link between production, diseases and food security will be a great event and will uh, support largely to feed the planet. Why strategies are to obtain that all members, countries, implement the OI international standards in the field of aquatic animal health and trade. For obtaining that uh, success, uh, we need uh, efficient uh, veterinary services or aquatic animal health services dealing with international standard of quality of that bodies. These standards are published by the OIE in agreement with all our members. The OIE propose to all members on a voluntary basis the opportunity to request an independent evaluation of their compliance with standards on quality and to provide their governments with that assessment in order to help to decide which priorities must be taken to comply with that standards. That uh, procedure is named OIE PVS Pathway. Evaluation being the first step, second step being the prescription in front of the gaps detected by the evaluation, we name the second step gap analysis. And that uh, gap analysis mission is proposed by the OIE using independent experts and giving to the government the cost of the compliance. And that provisional budget given to the countries by our experts allow the services in charge of prevention and control of disease to provide to the government the cost of compliance and the cost of the improvement of their efficiency. We also propose to our members parallel uh, supports, for example, legislative support, how to modernize the existing legislation of the country. And we have also independent experts trained by the OIE for that uh, purpose. We can also provide support to laboratories, particularly in developing countries, proposing a twinning with existing reference laboratories of the OI and providing support to the mechanism of twinning between existing reference laboratory and candidates of a developing country to become an OI reference laboratories. But we must also um, support our members by convincing governments and donors to provide resources to implement legislation and to give human and financial uh, resources for the implementation of the respect of the legislation and for the implementation of public-private alliances for building programs to fight, to control aquatic animal diseases.
the next steps uh, are to convince the maximum of members to apply on a voluntary basis uh, for uh, that uh, independent evaluation and to respect the outcomes of that procedure. Thanks to uh, that uh, product, to use them for convincing the government to invest in the field of any tool to prevent and control animal diseases in aquatic animals. And for very poor countries, to convince key donors such as World Bank or European Union, uh, USAID and many key donors worldwide, that uh, field is of interest and that poor country must be helped to make the appropriate uh, investment. Thank you.